Hi, so this is the second lithium battery review that I'm doing. The first lithium battery I bought from Lithium Power Inc. And they're actually the same battery. So if you see these from different brands like uh, Tenergy or Lithium Power Inc., they're the same battery. And the reason why I know they're the same battery is because uh, when I bought from Lithium Power Inc., there was simply a sticker placed on top of this other sticker. And, and I could see the logo a new pal underneath so they're, they're all the same battery and they look the same uh, but going back to the review this battery last I, I used the stopwatch and I did it about three times three runs and the battery lasts four hours and 20 minutes uh, which is a very long time it's rated or it's advertised to last about four hours uh, so the other lithium battery that I got lasted about three hours and 45 minutes uh, but really it depends on uh, how it's being used, if it goes over the rug or it uses uh, more power when it goes over a rug, uh, stuff like that. So uh, there might be differences in that. But uh, I got an especially good one here and this one lasts 4 hours 20 minutes. Well, a couple things you do want to know about this. These things are lighter by a pound compared to these iRoomba kind of compared to these iRoomba lithium, I, I mean, uh, NIM batteries. So this is very heavy. This is a pound heavier than this. Uh, so just keep that in mind. Uh, these things are a lot tighter fit. So um, you, you don't have to, un unlike what you might read on, say, Am Amazon uh, comments or whatever, uh, you don't have to, it, it'll fit perfectly. It, you don't need to put some type of paper clip or whatever to to hold it in place or the contacts don't match from the two that I bought they for, uh, fit perfectly but it is a tighter fit and the reason why it's a tighter fit is if you look at the cover there's there's this ring here and this is actually a tighter so for the normal battery here it sort of just fits and there's some give to it uh, whereas with this lithium battery, it actually fits kind of perfectly up here. So just keep that in mind also. Um, another thing to keep in mind with these batteries is that they don't actually run four hours straight. Uh, the charge will last four hours, but because the Roomba has a cleaning cycle, usually uh, depending on how many walls it hits or how many things it bumps into, uh, the cleaning cycle might just stop. Um, in which case, uh, you'll have to manually restart the Roomba by pushing clean. So for me, when I clean four straight hours, you, you might not want to do that. You might want to give it like a 10, 15 minute rest in between uh, every you know hour and a half or two hours simply because you don't want to overheat the Roomba. I don't know if there is actual such a thing, but um, you know, just keep that in mind. You don't want to overheat anything uh, because you are running it for you know four hours straight with this battery. So one thing you have to you do have to be aware of is uh, the Roomba itself, just the way it's programmed, has nothing to do with the battery. Won't clean four straight hours. So when the cleaning cycle ends, you just have to push clean again, and you might have to do that uh, two times or three times simply because uh, this is you know you're cleaning for four hours, um, and the light will change color. So it says this in the instruction manuals and it is true I, I've tried this and even with my other Roomba and other lithium battery um, it starts out green the the battery indicator light on the top of the Roomba and after about two hours it'll turn orange uh, don't be concerned because that still means there's two more hours and one or maybe one and a half hours left and even when it turns red um, it will uh, still probably have an hour and a half or an hour left. Um, for me, the docking light started blinking probably three hours and 45 minutes into the battery uh, based on the stopwatch that I was using. So uh, just be aware of that. Um, and also, if you have the docking plugged in, it'll actually dock after the cleaning cycle. So uh, you do want to unplug the docking station uh, and I end up not using the docking station much uh, anymore uh, be after I got this battery or these type of batteries simply because, you know, if you're cleaning four hours, uh, 
you know, you don't want it to return to the docking station after an hour and a half and recharge because these things do last four hours. So um, that that is a major kind of, uh, you know, thing that most people might not know about buying these lithium batteries. Uh, but, you know, overall, uh, it's a great battery and I, this is my second battery, second lithium battery of, uh, you know, kind of the, uh, out of kind of the, the three brands, Tenergy, Lithium Power Inc. and A New Pal. So, uh, this is my review of A New Pal, which is, uh, you know, basically exactly the same thing, uh, just uh, branded differently from the other two. So, um... But that's really it. That's uh, all I wanted to say about this. And uh, thank you for watching.